job for this, obviously, is to keep the heat away. Oh, that probably sounds like a damn earthquake, I'm sorry. Ladies and gentlemen, it is, is it is a great morning here in the old space in North Dakota. Sorry about yesterday's video being really short. My apologies. I didn't really know how long the video was going to be. I was yapping a lot, I'd say, but um, I woke up pretty early this morning and then my body decided, you know what? Fuck all that. And I went back to bed for some reason. And then I woke up at 9.30 and I'm like, mm, I have work at 12. Uh, it's going to be risky if I include all these like yapping sessions in the video. So I just kind of made it short and sweet. I hope I got the point across anyway. I did not expect to be up to 4,000. What was I? 4,400. So I'm like, Jesus Christ. My goal was just 3,300, man. And then Crispin Green said, no. You know what? You're going to have another extra 700 calories. So this, it's not going to be just a normal bulk. I was at a pretty good surplus to say the least. And then today, since I woke up a little bit late, I didn't get the chance to make breakfast because, you know, like I said, I had to edit and all that kind of stuff. So I think what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to, unfortunately, you Boy's gonna have to spend money on uh, on food. Well, I did yesterday, but you know, whatever. Me and audience member decided to agree on crisp and green, and it was good. Uh, it, it was good, but like, damn, it's expensive. Today we're not having crisp and green. We're gonna be having either kidoba or pancheros. So let's say the the bowl that I get at uh, Chip Pancheros is about 700 calories. I got the Gatorade bar. That's 300 calories, almost 400. So that's about a thousand, over a thousand actually. And then in total, maybe that goes up to 60 uh, 60 grams of protein. I'll have my midnight snack later, which is also a thousand calories. And then yeah, I think I think I think we'll be well we'll, we'll be all right today. Depends on what dinner is. I left like on the bulk, like I have like a bulk sheet. I left dinner as TBD pretty much. I don't want to be headlocked into this certain like food every single day with every single meal. I just kind of have like a base like meal that I want to eat every single day that covers a lot of the calories and then you know whatever I feel like it afterwards I, I you know I just eat whatever. It's a good balance ladies and gentlemen. That's a tip for you people that want to start bulking have no idea how to do it or whatever you're new to the gym whatever. I'd suggest having like let's say what I do let's say I have like a certain breakfast if you do midnight snacks there you go I guess have a certain midnight snack and also have a couple of snacks throughout the day and then that covers like a good amount of the calories and then give yourself a little bit of freedom when it comes to eating other things i guess like for lunch or for dinner uh give yourself freedom man it's a good balance it's a good balance all right i'm gonna have to pay charles right now actually all right ladies and gentlemen so uh I hey brody ah, bro bro how did you miss that either way as i was saying i did not get the calculation of the time right i got to pancheros and uh and it was like 10 before 12. i got there and the line was pretty full so obviously i wouldn't have been able to make it to work on time so now who guess who's gonna clutch it up for us Fucking DoorDash, yes sir. Oh, DoorDash, always clutching it up for it. Ah, oh, hell with it. You know what? I'm gonna have, uh, I'm gonna have five guys. I'm gonna have five guys. Damn. At the same time. Ah ha ha. Ah ha ha. Ah ha ha. Ah ha ha. Five guys. Time. I swear this is probably gonna be the last time for a while that I'm gonna talk about like calories and you know like macros and all that kind of stuff no additional toppings 1060 calories 51 grams of protein then i added grilled onions jalapenos peppers and then a hot sauce ketchup so yeah maybe 1100 calories chocolate milkshake 200 calories we're looking just fine what do you think of this meal brody don't call me a big bag you're the big bag so this meal all in all 1200 to 1300 calories and then now the milkshake god damn all right, boys and girls, I just ate my protein bar, my little Gatorade protein bar. So I'm, I'm, I'm up there when it comes to calories now, but this is historic, boys. I'm waiting for dogs to go home right now, and um, Brody's never the last one, and now he's the last one. <laughs> All right, I'll spoil it here for the hell of it. Yeah, easy, it's easy. Good catch. Uh, leg day. I'm feeling Dave's hot chicken for some reason. I don't I don't know what it is. I don't know what it, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Am I gonna have to make another video about being addicted to foods? Maybe. Dave's hot chicken's another one. Bro, am I actually gonna have to make a, a I'm addicted to Dave's hot chicken video? Guys, I don't have a healthy diet, all right? And I've never claimed to have one. And if I did, I was a liar. I think I'm gonna have Dave's hot chicken tonight. When's your mom gonna get here? Oh, oh, here's your mom. All right, let's walk out with you. My parents gave me this like little foil thing to cover the sun or whatever. The job for this obviously is to keep the heat away. Oh, that probably sounds like a 
damn earthquake. I'm sorry. Obviously, the point is, is to keep the, the the heat away from my car, but I'm not gonna lie to you guys. It's not working. It is actually working a little bit, but you know, it's still kind of warm in here. Not surprised. Either way, boys, I'm gonna go home, honey and salt, and then gym. Let's go ahead and get up on out of here, yes? Ah, uh, go home, relax nights. Probably gonna light up the campfire, have a cigar. Talk about a perfect day, guys. Yeah? It's just gonna be one of those nights that you're gonna look forward to, you know what I mean? But you gotta get all this stuff done first that you wanna accomplish. And then once that's all said and done, you go home and have a beautiful night. And that's that's gonna be my thing today. That's gonna be what I'm looking forward to. Gonna have a pretty hard leg day and then after we're gonna have a we're gonna go to walmart eat set up camp for oh it's just gonna be a fantastic day so today might not be anything special guys but you know it's just gonna be one of those days where you know you guys come come with me and just hang out with me for the day and hopefully this video is long enough so let me teleport to the to the crib really quickly all right and all right, boys, so it's gonna change you really quickly. If you guys paid attention yesterday, um, I, I wore this I wore this exact fit yesterday. Leg day, leg day, leg day. It's time to rock and roll at the gym, boys. Yes, sir. Which also, actually, I wanted to I wanted to add really quickly. I kind of had this like idea in the back of my head. The things that I ate yesterday for the bulk, a lot of it had a lot of sodium. I looked up how much one yakisoba had, and it was definitely, I think it was 2,000 milligrams of sodium. That's way more than like the average, like, recommend a daily intake for sodium. It was made more apparent to me when Cassandra like, like commented or whatever. I thought, you know what, maybe I should like revise my, my bulking like, you know, meals and stuff and go for a more healthier option. And I think, uh, I think I've made a pretty good uh, change now. So I have it in my notes. I'll shop after the gym and I'll talk more about it and stuff. So you guys will see what I'm gonna start planning. And next time I do a full day of eating, it'll be the more healthier option. Uh, yesterday was definitely not healthy. And like I said, I never said that my bulk was gonna be healthy, but I, I just want to make sure that it's not incredibly unhealthy. You know what I mean? Made for me. All right, boys, just got done with Walmart. Let's have a, a little bit of a, just a tiny car talk, right? We're gonna talk about a little bit of the stuff that I bought. So a lot of it's just pretty much reloading on everything that I need. So eggs, like just to, like the, you know, the whole foods. Yogurt, I, I'm gonna start doing some yogurt. And then the big thing is also chia seeds. Uh, chia seeds, I wanna start adding chia seeds to like, uh, to like a diet. I've always known about chia seeds, but then I didn't, like I haven't, I've never like put it like into practice, you know what I mean? I've always known that it's got like pretty good like macros and stuff, but I just just, I don't know, I just never got around to researching it more and stuff. So what I'm planning, correcting, of course, I'm going to be correcting my bulking, like, foods, right? What I'm going to do is I'm going to, like, for breakfast, I'm going to have a lot of uh, chia seeds, definitely. So, like, I'd say three tablespoons of chia seeds. That's going to be evenly distributed with on top of the eggs or on top of uh, on top of the yogurt that I'm going to consume every morning. And with the mixture of all that, uh, that, that ends up to about... A thousand calories for breakfast, right? Which is really good. Ice cream is also another thing that I'm like uh, trying to indulge in a little bit now since uh, I feel like I could have some yakisoba almost every night, but I feel like I can't have it every night. The sodium in it is too ridiculous. It's too crazy. 2,000 milligrams of sodium. That's that's crazy. So my midnight snack, I guess, technically is like uh, two servings of, uh, of ice cream, four toasts, some peanut butter, of course. That's going to be my midnight snack. Really getting to more of a cleaner bulk when it comes to the stuff that I have like set for each day. For the stuff that I don't have set, so like let's say lunch or dinner, I'm just gonna stick to whatever it is, just like tonight, which is gonna be Dave's Hot Chicken. I could be a little bit careless when it comes to like the dinner and lunch. Of course, I wanna make sure the calories are up there, but like I don't have to micromanage or macro manage. There you go. I guess it'll make me feel better. You know what I mean? It'll make me feel better to, to eat healthier with the bulk and stuff. I mentioned earlier that Cassandra kind of pointed it out in the comment section. And I knew that like the the noodles were a little bit iffy. I didn't realize how iffy it was going to be. Two pancicantons, which is uh, already a crazy amount of sodium. And then one yakisoba at night. That's, that's too much sodium. So we'll cut back on the sodium. We'll just have sodium if whatever meal I eat during the day consists of it. But when it comes to the set meals that I'm going to eat, we're going to be cutting it back on the sodium. For those of you that are new when it comes to, um, you know, uh, fitness and stuff. I don't want to throw out a percentage on this because I don't really know. Here's what I'll tell you. A lot of fitness, a majority of fitness is eating, right? The macros, all that kind of stuff. A good amount of it is lifting, right? But the majority of it is what you eat. All right. 
Alrighty boys, as we're feeding the fishies here, let's quickly chat. So, yeah man, just wanted to enjoy the night, relax and stuff, and talk about the weekend plans with Christian, you know what I'm saying? We got some stuff cooking up. Not sure if I'm gonna be recording any of it, but I'll, I'll, uh, I might record some of it. Been a pretty decent day. I don't exactly know what this whole video is gonna be about. I don't know if it's gonna be about, like, the bulking stuff. Dave's hot chicken, I don't know. No, I had some Dave's hot chicken, of course. I'm a little bit tired now, so, well, not a little bit, I'm pretty tired, so I'm gonna go to bed and, uh, just have another day tomorrow, you know what I mean? Good thing is, though, little side note, so far, the fish tank seems to be doing pretty well. It's, it's holding up pretty well, so. I have different plans with this fish tank as well and um i have i have different ideas of how i want to improve this whole thing so whenever i have more time i'll uh, i'll cook up a, an idea for these guys all right but besides that that's about it boys thank you all so much for watching this video appreciate you as always gonna go to bed edit this video tomorrow and uh, move on for the next day love you guys see you guys tomorrow but wait uh, turn around no, I got options. Begging me to go, but I tell her to stop it. Always got the key, and my heart is the lock it. Yeah, 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 yeah. I like a pro, but you're really a novice.